What is up, my dragon crew? Dragon here. Welcome back to Sonic Colors Ultimate. It has been a while since we've uh, done this game. As always, uh, we have AG on board as well. She is also going to be my... She's my co-host to this. So, Yay! Hello! I exist! Hi! <laughs> and last time, last episode, we have done Sweet Mountain. It was really fun, Yay! but now... Go home. But now... We now must go on to the next world, AG. Bye, my home. I love you so much. I'll be back soon. But, but I did pick another world. We're going to be going to Aquarium Park today. Oh, we're going swimming. All right, I'll go grab the sunscreen. <laughs> <laughs> All right, here we go. Now, for, nice. now for people, people, please forgive me if I'm a little rusty. I haven't played this game in a while, so... Water. All right, there we go. I thought about swimming, like joining a swim team or anything, bro. Yeah. I love swimming. As you guys can see, I've customized Sonic some more. I gave him uh, yellow shoes. Or, no, not yellow shoes. Wait, I don't think it's yellow. Oh, it's orange shoes. I'm sorry. Orange. Dang. See, the smile I got on my face when you said yellow was like, oh, thanks. And then you said orange was like, oh, should have known. <laughs> <laughs> sorry. All right, let's go over here. Oh, oh, dang it, missed it. Same thing. Ow. Go fast. Oh, Aquarium Park looks really cool. Oh, I keep... Can I the sushi bar there? Uh, looks like it. Oh, a sushi bar there, do you know that? Yeah. Delicious. I've I mean, been I, I don't I've, have the sushi, I've been here I mean, before. I can't leave it. All right, here's a close Team look. Up, here's a close look at Sonic. Hey. Looking good. It's time you can to get an S rank. Go, 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 go. Got it. Oh my God, the robots even have samurai-looking designs. Pirate. Pirate? Yeah, pirate. That's even cooler. Wow, you are doing pretty good at this, dragon. Ha. Ah. Get Mobius. Here all week. Get to your waiters. No! It's okay. I'm good. No. I feel bad for Sonic because we all know that some versions are not the biggest fans of water. Yeah. I mean, when I met Alex's Sonic, the Sonic from his dimension, I found out that uh, his biggest fear is actually snakes. Water. Hmm, I see. Understandable because, um,. <laughs> to me pretty scary. It reminds me of Indiana Jones, you know. Why does it always have to be snakes? <laughs> yeah. Oh, loops. Oh, God. i probably get sick going through those. Oh, shit. Are you still underwater? Nope. Been away from there. Oh. Oh. I, I have trouble telling sometimes. You're fine. Hey. How have you been, buddy? Uh, been okay. Two. We're just working on some more homework for our, you know, university stuff. I'm nice surprised. Like going to university really expects you to take oh. care of all your assignments in a timely fashion. Oh, don't die! Alright, I'm fine. No, I'm just worried about you, brother. Hmm. There you go. I can't go up there, then. That's the bad thing. Get yeah. off, oh, shoot. The jip. Wait, what's down here? I don't know. You can actually do that? Yeah. What's down here? Oh, now you're- Oh, God! It's okay. You can- you can jump infinite. You can jump infinitely. See? Infinitely. Whatever. <laughs> I'm a grammar freak. Oh, wow. See? Not that bad. Dang, the Sonic just plummeted, and I was like, oh, no. I can very much understand his fear of drowning. I have a fear of that too, because it's just the whole feeling of, oh, I'm not getting any air and I need it to breathe. <laughs> oh, so that's a thing! Yep. <laughs> Death by boxes. Silver would be proud. Oh, yeah. Should you just homing attack them if you wanted to? No. You know how to homing attack? Sadly, you can't homing attack, Pace. I meant, do you know how to do it? Yeah. yeah. Santi, Amy, I know how to spin dash and homing attack. 
It's painful on the stomach and the ribs, but eh, I don't mind it. I've kind, of, I've kind of gotten used to it. Yeah. E A or A G. Yep. Nice. What's that line supposed to be? That line that's. That, uh, that's that... I said like a timer just in case like we get the bonus stuff. Oh. Oh, my back! Sometimes I think I'm getting old. Ow. You're 21. I'm a year older. Yeah, but... Come on, bro. If you were in my shoes or boots, you'd probably feel old, too. No, not really. I mean, 21, I'm in my 20s. I never... To this day, I didn't expect myself to get this far in life. Pretty much just yesterday, I was a little 13-year-old hedgehog running around at the middle school playground. Hmm having to help my twin sister gather up the courage to go on the monkey bars because she was always afraid of falling. Alright, but we're gonna have to focus on this one. But then again, she had to help me get over my fear of going on the seesaw because, uh... Oh, I had a seesaw incident in elementary school where, uh... A friend who was on the seesaw, you know, like when you, when you yeah. go back down? Let's just say, uh, she pushed too hard and I flipped over and I hit my back on the rail. Yikes. Yeah, and that made me afraid to go on a seesaw ever since. Hmm. Until, like I said, when I turned 13 and my twin says helped me overcome that fear. Oh, okay. That was something. <laughs> Tails. You wanna know what I thought he said when I first heard him say that? What is it? I thought he said, you're all dead! Oh my god. I thought he said dead! And I was like, okay, morbid Tails? I know you don't wanna have to save Sonic all the time, but jeez. It was like, but then I realized quickly afterwards that he said, I could do this all day. Mm hmm Yeah. Both a mood and a truth, actually. When it comes to being a hero, that's kind of an all-day thing. Okay. Making me think of Alex. Mm hmm Speaking uh, of partners, uh, how's uh, Sarah uh, doing? Uh, she's actually doing pretty good. You guys having fun, you know, doing stuff? You got on any dates lately? Nah, yeah, we went on one. Corruption, oh, corruption's yeah. over, so might as well. Yeah. Excuse me, I want to forget about that. Miss Big Hero Mobius. <laughs> oh, but for a second I thought we were going to say Big Hero 6, and it's like, oh, you want to watch that movie tonight? <laughs> sure, I'll grab the squad. Boyfriend told me everything. Ugh. <sighs> Yeah, clearly. I love how my big moment as a heroine <clears throat> in Mobius is through act. Yeah. Both I've hands. done it a few times. Against act. Berserk and Corrupt Beast. Oh, no. Well, I just, I well, just, well, Berserk did it. I know, I just wish that... Are you eating? Yeah, I'm eating popcorn. See? Got one? Fork it over, thank you. You're welcome. Oh, me, I live in a planet of sweets. Of course I'm gonna want some of this stuff. <laughs> I just can't believe that my big moment where I'm recognized as a heroine is through that. It's not that bad. Just, gets, eh, just takes a while to get... Well, just takes a while to get... Dragon. Just takes a while to get used to. It's not that. It's not the fact that I'm a hero. I've always wanted to be seen as a heroine. It's just the means of how I became one. Ugh, it's the equivalent of becoming a hero. Okay, let me put it to you this way, Dragon. What is your least favorite universe that you've ever visited? That you've ever visited? Uh, that's a good question. Something that annoys you to no end and the fact that everybody likes it ticks you off. Name something that, that you hate that everyone else loves. I don't really think we should name it. Whatever. Whatever that is, that's kind of. And now, now imagine becoming a hero through those means, doing your doing something that you really hate. Yeah, I, I get that. That's how it felt when I. Thanks. Hey, oh, excuse me. This Bless you. Thank you. Basically, take that and equate that to how I ended up saving the multiverse. It wasn't through my angelic energy. I know. It wasn't through my genuine musical talents. I know what it or... was. 
me green or me bringing everyone together to collectively fight as a team. No, it was through a rap battle. I mean, they're not uh, that, they're not bad. I mean, I could show you. Some, I, I just show you a way or two. Just for fun. No, I, if I want to listen to rap, I can listen to Eminem and MC Hammer. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, those are really good. Of course. I mean, my honey also got me into rappers like Tupac and 50 Cent and, you know, ones like that. Mm -hmm. yeah. My honey's got great taste in music. <laughs> yeah. Sarah got into any music? Like, I don't know, jazz? Or she likes jazz. Yeah, she got me like into jazz. it. Like jazz? So, Dragon. Hmm? Like jazz? Oh. <laughs> Gosh. Yeah, let's just say that, um, just one positive thing. Mm -hmm. I can say after defeating that, you know, whole thing. Um, has now motivated me to hopefully save the world from something even bigger so that can get swept under the rug and I can be known as the heroine of Mobius. Or something better than that. Hmm. You know, maybe using Battle of the Bands or something. I don't mm. like, like that. If we get to, know. if it gets to that point, then yeah, that could be one of them. Just, or maybe unlocking a new power or something, you know, that could be something I would not mind, you know, achieving. God, that will forever be on my record as a heroine. It's the equivalent of getting an F after getting A's for the entire semester. Mm -hmm. I mean, sure, that one F won't destroy your average, but it'll be there. And when you look back at your report and you see that one F, you're going to just be like, oh. Speaking of F, mm -hmm. thought about going to the university? Like, wow. Speaking here? of F, really? Could have said something else. I mean, if it, well, if I have nothing to do, or, yeah. Sure. Not, you're not much of a scholarly dude, I can tell. <laughs> uh, yeah. Oh, well, it's a requirement for muses to get an education. Oh, I couldn't escape that even if I wanted to. How long do you got left? About, uh, a little over a year. That's eh, not I bad. I'm supposed to be graduating next year, I think, but, um, me with my overachieving self, my twin sister's planning on doing an extra year, so, I mean, because mm -hmm. I really want to go above and beyond so I can get my degree, but, eh, if I'm up to it, if I can handle it, I might go another year after my supposed graduation year. Because the minimum requirement is, you know, two to four years, and I'm approaching my fourth year. I'm almost done with my third. Yeah. My knowledge, I gotta check my report. So, oh, yeah, have you... Have you talked to Professor Pickles? Any uh, chance? You know him, right? It's been years since I've seen him. He teaches one of my classes. Wow. That's shocking. How do you think I felt? Hmm. Teaches part of one class, and I've seen that before with some teachers at the university. It's like, oh, I enjoy teaching, so I teach more than one class. Is he going on about the sandwiches again? Uh, no. Uh, but he does teach a cooking class, so <laughs> I see uh, that the class where that, I see that's it, the class where he probably goes off on it. Wow, shocker. I mean, my new sisters are taking a cooking class with them, so. <laughs> there you go. Well, then again, she's. Getting married, so she wants to learn how to cook for her partner, which is very sweet. Mm -hmm. It's like I need, I'm getting married. I need to learn how to cook. <laughs> <laughs> you maybe you one day you, yeah, I do. Wait, what? Maybe one day uh, you might cook for Alex in the future. <laughs> well, I mean, he already can cook. Uh, he, <laughs> he showed me that he knows how to handle a stove. <laughs> Uh, he can do anything! He's perfect! <laughs> well, I mean, he's the total package, with the exception of some flaws, but that makes him even more perfect. And yeah. He's, he's not perfect. Everyone has their flaws. Yeah, you have them too. Yep. No, does. no I do. Yeah. yeah. <sighs> so, wait, random question. When it comes to mm -hmm. hero stuff, like. So, do you have any other hobbies aside from being a hero and working at GUN? Like, is that your pretty much... Like, you know how my big thing is, you know, I have college life, my band life, and of course, when I'm not being a heroine, I'm focusing on that stuff. 
is that what GUN is? Is that kind of your when you're not helping to save the world, you're being a GUN, GUN is part of helping the world. Yeah, it's just like I guess it's like a it plays into the it plays into it, I guess. Eh, fair enough. How did you decide to apply for GUN? I actually applied for it years ago. I just got back to you. <laughs> it's like they're starting yeah, to Yeah, it came it. it came back to me before <laughs> corruption happened. It's like, who's this orange bozo? Oh, Dragon, right, we forgot we were planning on hiring him. Did we last send that email? Uh, I've been it's in been G over I've, a year. I've been GUN for, like, approximately seven years. Seven? Well, I never knew that about you. Why, right. you why do you think I'm a lieutenant? Makes sense. What did you start as, a private? Uh, or, rookie. Uh, rookie, right. What was that like? What did you do? Just get coffee for the commander and stuff? Actually, yeah. That was a start, but I confronted him <laughs> saying I wanted to like, do some missions and everything. And he took did it. Did you see you walking in? He took, it, he took, he took, it, he took, it, up, he took it upon. He took that upon it. So, and here I am <laughs> now. Ah, shoot. <laughs> oh, so I'm ah, just imagining a sitcom-like situation where you where you walk in like, Here's your coffee, sir. Thank you, Dragon. Dragon. Yeah, whatever. Dragon? <laughs> It's the joke of, you know, how, you know, the the underdog, you know, the, the boss, you know, pr mispronounces the hero's name. And then, you know, eventually, like, I'm very impressed with you, Dargan. Dragon. Dargan. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> and then finally they get your name right, and it's like, you got my name right. Hmm. It's like, wow, that really shows that you have that I have evolved. <laughs> Don't worry, my, people have surprisingly messed up my name. One time at a restaurant... Someone called me Ag instead of Ag. Ag. It's because of my initials. The idiot who wrote down my order forgot to put the dots. Ah. Uh. Yes, there was like a uh, pasta bowl for Queen Ag. I was like, Ag. All right, there we go. Got the next one done. Nice. By the way, it's not like shoes orange or yellow. Orange. Yeah. Oh, no. oh, they're orange. <laughs> I can buy the yellow shoes for another episode, but we'll, I'll save that for the last one. Love yellow. Put your dog with you? Unfortunately. Hello, pets at the at the base by any chance, like a G one, or is he is he like your you know you're your, in my, your you're in my house, remember? Oh, sorry, dog. All right, but I'm just asking, like, do you ever bring your dog to work? Do no. they ever do a bring your dog to work day? <laughs> if I want my dog dead in a mission, yeah, I would. But I don't want my dog dead. <laughs> I'd rather keep him. Thank you. No. Hey, that's the same thing with my dog, as always. Same thing with my doggies. Right. Two dogs, do you have one, two? Uh, one. Two dogs. Two cats. Mm, no. You're no. not a cat person, are you? <laughs> well, I want a cat, but Aww. it's kind of impossible. Ah, sh no. dang it. Oh, no! Dang it, it's okay. I'm on my way. Alright, here we go. So, your dog. Mm -hmm. He's yeah. adorable. So, I, see a, I see a photo of him. She. He's adorable. She. <laughs> Oh, she! Yeah. Aww. We should have our pets get together, you know? Because, uh, I would love to, you know, introduce my dogs my dogs and cats to, you know, folks, because I notice ah, that they're yeah. a little shy at the... Notice that my two doggies can be a bit shy at the dog park. Yeah, I agree. <laughs> like, I tell Jojo and Ella, go play, go play, go make new friends, and they just, they, they just like to cuddle on the picnic table and blanket, and I'm like, no, you're supposed to go have fun. Go have fun. And then they like when I let them off their leashes and they go, they turn right back around and come back to me. Yeah. No, I, I'm not a I, dog. I'm a hedgehog. I can see that. I mean, uh, people joke about me being, well, me and my twin sister being like, oh, you guys are like Disney princesses because animals just flock to you. It's like, our pets, of course they flock to us. Yeah, that would be Snow White when it comes to animals. Ah! Do that. <laughs> I actually worked one time. I'm not kidding. That actually worked. Wow. 
Oh, that was risky. Except burst didn't, except burst didn't come to us. We were in the chow garden, and ah. then suddenly, like, seven chow, like, waddled up to us. And we're like, oh, it works! Hmm. The chow. Have you ever thought about getting a, a chow? Yes, I am, actually. Oh, what do you want to name it? Uh, I have no idea. Spice? Like a pumpkin spice? Funny. <laughs> wait, 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 wait! Oh. Oh. Ah, damn it! Oh, snap. Wait, since this is Sonic Colors, have you thought about, you know, uh, yeah. ha having a wisp as a friend? Actually, I do. Ha actually, do plan to. Yeah. Yeah. Twin Sis and I love our wisps. I went the absolute wait, wait. wrong direction. Careful! Don't die! Ah, screw it. Which of these planets would you want to live on if you had the chance? Or if you were able to? Uh, I don't know. It's obvious which one I pick. <laughs> that is your home. Oh, well, yeah. I mean, that's where, our, where the Muse bases are, so of course, duh. I have a, I have research? a, I have a very curious question. Oh. Remember when we played Sonic Frontiers the other day that you said the yellow emerald's basically off you? What did you mean by that? Uh, well, the yellow emerald, at least in my dimension, not in general, but it's a very special gem. The yellow emerald in my dimension, um, look back, you know, like when Sonic goes super and then when he gets out of that form, all the emeralds, like, zip off into different directions? Yeah. I did mention the yellow emerald always goes back to the same place. Well, I know a level I'm redoing it off, off screen. <laughs> anyway, that yellow emerald always goes back to my castle. Nice. Because, um, it's got an attachment to my twins, this and I. Hmm. I think I've stated it before. I think I. I don't remember. I've been dimension well, hopping lately. <laughs> then I'll explain, simply. Put it simple, let's just say, um, emeralds in my dimension are very different than what you'd expect. If you want to use them individually, a sacrifice must be made, because they need to power off of something. Is it like, is it like, all seven emeralds, like, when it comes to seven. the Avengers and everything, is it like, the soul stone, like, a soul for a soul? If you want to put it that way, yeah, but nobody has to die. And it doesn't, like, take anything from you. Unless you really need it for something important. Right. It doesn't, like, kill you. Like, you don't have to, like, throw somebody off a cliff or anything. Or, you know, rip out your soul out of your body. That's exactly how the soul stone goes. Soul stone goes. Well, then that's not how my yellow, em how the emeralds work. But let's just say, okay, okay. um... Oh, thankfully, no. <laughs> Never heard mm. of that until now. It, now you have. Yeah. <clears throat> Basically... The story is pretty simple. My mother was, you know, pregnant with my twin sis and I, but the doctors, he uncovered something was going wrong during the pregnancy, and my mother was told that we weren't gonna make it. Wow. So in a state of panic and fear and desperation, you know, to have her kids be born, my abuelita, who was still alive at the time, bless her heart, she went on a perilous journey to try and find all the seven Chaos Emeralds, along with her sisters and some of the other older generation of muses. Try and find all seven Chaos Emeralds to, you know, help my mother out. Because who would do the same if you had a child? It's like, imagine, you're a grandma, you're about to be a grandma, but that chance is about to be taken away from you because of, you know, your daughter has medical troubles. So, of yeah. course you'd want to help her. Sadly... They couldn't find all seven of them fast enough and barely made any progress, and the only one they were able to find was the yellow one. Hmm. The yellow emerald hurt only because my mom was willing to sacrifice her vision to give us life, basically. Because uh -huh. my mom had the be used to have the used to have really good vision, but not the best vision out of everyone on the team. She gave it up, so my twin sister and I could be born. Sacrifice something so she can have, you know, live. Which, in my opinion, is a true hero thing right there. Hmm. Speaking of mom, Prince Dragon? Huh? 
But never mind, nothing. No, no, what did you say? You said, um, you think... Well, I was gonna just say, uh, can you imagine having a parent who's, you know, blind? They can't even look at, they can't even, they don't even know what their children look like, because that's my mom. I do feel bad. Ironically, though, my mom said that she, this is actually very sweet. Every time my sister and I would feel bad or guilty about our mom, you know, not being able to see anything, she says, I don't need to see with my eyes because I see with my heart. Hmm. She also says, I know, I don't need to see my daughters to know that they are the most beautiful and precious things in the world. <laughs> I see. Yeah, my mom is super sweet. We're like family to you, too. Hmm. I'm not flexing because I know that there are some friends that I have who either don't have parents or they have bad relationships with them. Uh, and, if, and if you're one of them, I apologize if I sound like I'm flexing. I, I'm not, though. Yeah, I do have family. It's you guys. Aw, thanks. Mm -hmm. Amazing! Uh, uh, you're amazing. I need to find a way to get that ring. Hopefully, I can reach it. Ah! Oh. No, I can't. Okay, you get it. Okay, there has to be a. Why did I? Oh, whoa, <laughs> Why did whoa. I do that? You just pulled a mater and fail. It's like I'm the world's best backwards rut dies. Okay. Oh. I'm gonna try and reach it. Okay. Ah, okay. Okay. Yeah. I, you get out I, I, I have to do this blind. Okay. Here we go. Oh. Here we go. Oh. 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 Almost. Now, you just got a double jump or something. Okay. Almost. Gain momentum. Uh, okay. Never mind. <laughs> Just, just kill the robots and then do it. Nah, it's okay. I don't need it. Aw, oh, dang it. Now I'm not gonna stop thinking about that. Frick. Oh, but you know the islands that we were visiting when we were hanging out um, in the Frontiers situation, right? Yeah. I know, I'm not crazy. I'm not crazy, but why do I want to go on vacation to one of those islands? I... I plan to. Imagine all three of us, well, all three, you know, you, you, Sarah, Chilled, Zoe, Alex, and I, all three of us on a full, you know, thing. Okay, wait, what? Just imagine us all sitting by the water, by the waterfall. At Chronos Island? A, yeah, we're all sitting on the water, we're all sitting by the water, by the huge waterfall. All having a picnic, you know, we're... If there I are no food. if there are Gen no titans around, then sure. Well, I mean, pretty sure the titans are gonna be, you know, defeated. And if there are, we'll fight them off. We can do that, right? We need a bubble. If I can bubble, find bubble, bubble, bubble. You're not gonna make it. You're not gonna make it. Oh, Sonic died. Oh, well, I got a ring, <laughs> and don't know if that counts. It didn't count. You're crazy, but whenever Sonic drowns, it's actually very creepy. Okay, I, I'll keep the- okay, the fish actually helps. So I cannot get hit by the fish. By anything. If I get hit by anything, it, I'm screwed. Oh, am I the only one who gets, like, a little uncomfortable whenever Sonic starts to drown, or when he actually does drown? Are you talking about the whole sink story? Oh, not the- the sink story, what are you talking about? There's a sink story where a version of Sonic actually actually drowns by Eggman. By leaving him in the ocean, and well, it's not so not the ocean, but this zone will scare you. The labyrinth zone. Oh no! Wait, wait. So Eggman just drops Sonic into the water and just leaves him there? No, he traps him there. Oh my god! Oh, that, that that's disturbing. Ah, I don't want to imagine it because you know what happens when your body is not getting any air. You start to become weak. You, your body starts to get heavy, you won't yeah. be able to move, and, uh, just, You just practically fatigue, and the last thing that happens is your brain starts to shut down, and then just... Considering it's like a late Halloween thing, I'm gonna say, well, I'm gonna say this. Oh. Sonic ripped his chest open. Just to breathe? breathe. Yeah. 
Here, I'll tell you the story after this. I'll tell you the story later because we're at the boss now. That's the sushi bar. Yeah. Yeah, let's not talk about the whole thing. We'll talk about it later. Sonic, they're not responding to you, bro. <laughs> Why is he talking like me? Mm-hmm. Isn't that your Sonic? You're it... not entirely wrong. I know. Don't be dissing. Hey, don't be dissing on my Sonic like that, bro. Who said I was dissing on him? Just I'm kidding, just pointing bro. an obvious fact. He's actually very smooth, though. I can highly agree. Just a chatterbox. Just a chatterbox. He can't help it. He loves interacting with his friends. That's every Sonic. Yeah. And is your Sonic like a famous rocker too? I don't have a Sonic. Right, I forgot. Right, I forgot you're from Prime, aren't you? I'm from this universe. You're from Mobius Prime, right? Sorry. Yeah. Right, you're from the center! So that explains why there are variants of you. Wait, what? Think. I'm being hypothetical here because I don't know. I'm still getting used to multiverse logic. How long have I been, you know, interacting with people from other zones? What, since, like, what, two and a half years I've been interacting with people from other zones? I believe. I'm still not used to everything yet. I need to collect rings. It... Oh, oh, I need that. Yeah, I'm unfazed by most. By most. Yes, thank you, Brain. With the, 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 the lisp. I've been on. Yes, I'm, I'm talking like the Mad Hatter. I've been unfazed by most of the stuff I've witnessed here. God. I meant to say, I've been unfazed by more of the stuff that I've started to witness here. That's better. <laughs> you know me, I'm a goofball. We know. <laughs> yeah, you are too, doofus. Yeah. Dang it. You're Sarah's goofball. Ah, come on. Bubble! I'm trying. Oh god. I'm trying to go out to this guy one more hit, because I'm about to die, which is one bad thing. No! There, there are bubbles right there! No, I, I'm running out of rings. Ah! Shh, there out. are rings right there! There are rings right there! Hold on, I gotta get a bubble. Wow. I don't think you're gonna beat that. No, I, no, it's only a matter of time. I can do it. What? Never mind. Okay, cool. Well, <laughs> uh, dang. Life literally came in and said, I disagree with your opinion. Alright, I need to have these. Water with all right, water. These missiles have to follow me. Seek a blue ball. How did Sonic even. Okay. Hey. Okay. Well, quick question about the sink story. Uh, sure. Did he rip his chest open? Did he carry a knife with him? Did he use his bare hands? Bare hands. How does he do that? I'm like, why am I even thinking about doing that? Because there was got... no, there was no other option. How did he do it though? Did he just grab it himself? Yep. He grabbed his chest. But he... he doesn't have claws. How could he? Could he even? How is that? He, the strength, the strength, the strength he had left. Let's go with that. Jeez. Can you like hold oh. still, you fuck? Okay, sick. <laughs> that was funny. You're like, finally, jeez. No, I didn't hit him. Oh, helmets. Give me the bubble. Thank you. Where is he? There he is. Hit him once. Once. Hit him twice. Hit him three times. Bah, bah, bah. <laughs> ah. yeah, that's wrong. That thing's really ticking you well, off. still got him. Finally. One more hit for this face. I'm still bad. Well. Got him. All right. Round. All right. Round two. Jeez. Now I really gotta focus. 
Because there's going to be a lot more missiles than before. Oof. Uh. Give me a bubble. Bubble. Oh. Bubble. 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 Yeet. Oh, thank God. Always scares me. Like, actually scares me, but you know what I mean. Yeah. Give me a freaking thank you. Honestly, I would panic legitimately if I needed to get a bubble. Okay, I got what I needed. Now I need to go ahead and get this. Oh, it was I right on me. It's right on me. Final question. How long can you hold your breath? You tell me. I don't know about you. Only you would know that. I know. I think the max I can hold my breath is like 10 minutes and 33 seconds. That's because that's how long the unedited version of Freebird is. Basically, <laughs> it's a weird thing that muses have when it comes to certain abilities that require you to hold out. Basically, in order to survive underwater, we have to we have to mentally sing song, longest song that we know. Oh, two hits there. That equates to how long we can handle like holding our breath or like Got in the air or under the water. Nice. Finally. Give me the rings and fucking die. <laughs> Give me the rings and freaking die. Yeah, all right, we did it. Stop. I don't know what I don't know if you heard what I said about you know holding your breath underwater or, or in general with how long I can. I could it. I could for a while. Yeah, my max is like ten minutes right now because I know like. The longest song that I know is Freebird, which means the longest song that a muse can sing or hum or know the tune of pretty much equates how long they can hold their breath for. You're going to be shocked when, how, how long I can tell, I tell you I'm mine. You're, you're going to be Five shocked. Hours. Wait, what? Five hours? No. 30 minutes. Two. 30 minutes? 30? Yeah, 30 minutes. Oh. Only 20 more than me. You know what? I'm gonna try to beat that record. Good luck. Yeah? Who was on the swim team in high school? Me. Alright, we did it. Oh, uh, that was fun! Uh, Are we done? Yeah. Gosh, darn it. Yeah, we're done. Any final Talk words? Oh, much. Hey. Final words? Yes, this was so much fun, and I'm having a blast. Wait a minute. I'm gonna hold it. Wait, question. Mm -hmm. Hold on, question dragon? Yeah. Oh, wait, screen share back. Let's screen share back. Just tell me what is it. Just tell me. That's the planet with those with those uh, buzz saws popping out of the top. Oh, that's Planet Whips. That's Planet Wisp? Yeah. Jeez, it, looked a lot, it looked a lot different when I imagined it, huh? I guess I just have memory. But anyway, this was very fun. Thank you for having me. I can't wait to go to the next planet, whichever one that one's going to be. Yep. But in the meantime, hope you guys enjoyed. If so, leave a like, subscribe, click the notification bell if you want to see more. Don't forget to subscribe to AG over here. The, link will, the channel link will be in the description below. But in the meantime, this is Dragon Safe by my Dragon Crew. You all take care and have a good one, everyone. Goodbye. Yeah, my muses and agents of fortune. Bye.